Matthias has had enough of glasses. He decides to undergo laser eye surgery. I'm extremely active. I go hunting and windsurfing. Glasses are a real nuisance for these sports. Windsurfing with glasses just doesn't work. There came a point where I decided not to wear my glasses for surfing, but you don't see the waves well enough and that is a problem. Glasses are inconvenient when you're hunting in the rain. Raindrops on your specs are a problem, one which you want to get rid of. Birger wants to undergo laser treatment as well, because she cannot tolerate contact lenses anymore. I'm nearsighted and would normally have to wear glasses. I used contact lenses for years until I started to suffer from dry eyes. This meant I could no longer tolerate contact lenses, so I decided to have LASIK surgery. Thanks to refractive laser eye surgery, millions of people worldwide no longer need glasses or contact lenses. The Bellevue Eye Clinic in Kiel, Germany has many years of experience in the field of eye surgery. Specialist consulting and a careful pre-examination are indispensable before deciding to undergo laser surgery. The medical director of the clinic, Professor Detlef Uthoff, explains the LASIK treatment to the patients, which is the most commonly used procedure for refractive laser eye surgery. First the eye is fixed in place and a thin flap of the cornea is prepared. This flap is then lifted, allowing the pulses from the excima laser to be applied directly to the inside of the cornea and ablate the tissue. The flap is then replaced and that's it. Nearsightedness of up to around 8 to 10 diopters can almost always be corrected. We can deal with around 4, in some cases 5 diopters, in the case of farsightedness, and up to around 3 or 4 diopters with astigmatism. We do, of course, have other options apart from laser treatment. Since the beginning of the 1990s, refractive laser eye surgery has been based on certified safety standards. Depending on the state of the individual eye, there are several treatment methods and laser technologies to choose from. The entire procedure for both eyes takes about 10 minutes. We now work with a brand new laser, the Amaris. It compensates, for example, rotations of the eye or different positions of the eye, which we were unable to treat with other lasers in the past. The procedure using this laser is extremely rapid, essentially taking only seconds. The laser can correct not only nearsightedness, farsightedness and astigmatism, but also so-called higher-order aberrations. They are mainly due to slight irregularities on the corneal surface. Many patients thus see better after surgery than they did with spectacles or contact lenses. Do patients feel any pain during the treatment? It didn't hurt. I could feel the fixation ring during the treatment, but otherwise nothing. I was initially in awe of the whole process, but the operation itself was surprisingly unspectacular, at most spectacularly quick. I could hardly believe how soon it was over. It didn't hurt either. There was slight pressure when the fixation ring was put in position, but it was not really painful. Any dentist's appointment would be worse. What level of visual acuity will be obtained directly after the treatment? I can already see just as well as I would with glasses. Everything's still a little blurry, but I already notice a marked improvement in my vision compared to how I could see before without glasses. That's great, considering how recent the treatment was. Today, more than 20 years of experience and comparable study outcomes for the LASIK method are available. Even 10 years after treatment, no relevant changes in visual acuity are to be expected. Information on the remaining thickness of the cornea needed to prevent damage to the eye has been available for more than 25 years. Now, 
The only glasses that Matthias needs are sunglasses, without corrective lenses, of course.